I've been waiting for this all my life. I'm not gonna cry. <laughs> <laughs> Amir Thompson, better known as Questlove, has one of the most astonishing stories we've ever recovered. Records show that Amir's third great-grandparents, Charles and Maggie Lewis, were born in Africa sometime in the 1820s. Now that date stood out because the slave trade to the United States was outlawed as of January 1808. After that, very few enslaved Africans came into the United States meaning that Charles and Maggie must have been smuggled into this country illegally. Arrival of a cargo of African Negroes. Schooner Clotilda with Africans arrived in Mobile Bay today. A steamboat immediately took them up the river. On Monday, July 9th, 1860, a ship called the Clotilda arrived in Mobile Bay carrying 110 African slaves. It's the last known slave ship to come to America. Your family settled less than two miles from an area, Amir, you ready for this? Known as Africa Town, which was founded by survivors of the Clotilda. I'm on the absolute last ship that ever came here. We don't know exactly what happened to Questlove's ancestors when the Clotilda arrived, but we do know that five years later, after the end of the Civil War, they became farmers living close to the river where they first came ashore in America. Many of their descendants still live in that area, and thanks to them, we made an extraordinary find. You, Amir, are looking at your third great-grandfather. That is your original African ancestor, brother. That is Charlie Lewis. How? 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 How did you? A photo comes from a descendant of Charlie Lewis like you, one of your cousins. That's my great, great, great grandfather. That is your third great grandfather. The eyes are the same. Those are my eyes, man. <laughs> well, now you know where they came from. I, like, I'm not overacting. I'm not, uh, uh, yeah, I am at a loss of words. I'm just so overwhelmed right now because I never, I mean, until an hour ago, I didn't know who I was. I said I wasn't gonna cry, man. Mm -hmm. uh, I didn't know who I was or who I came from. Discovering the stories of our ancestors can be a profoundly transformative experience, changing the way we see ourselves, our families, and our shared history. To see more incredible stories, click here.